Um, Here's your host, Mr. Okay. Well, Phil Conrad. Hello. Good afternoon, everybody. Sorry. So, um, I, uh, I've been hosting open mics for six years in, in Vienna, Austria. First one started on my birthday, and, and it wasn't intentional. A bunch of people showed up, and I thought they should all play some songs, so I kind of like moderated it. And then people said, wow, you should do this for a living. And uh, I, I will never make a living doing this, but I continue to do this. Um, so in a sense, I am a, I don't know if you could call it a professional uh, open mic host, but um, yeah. If you've ever been paid, you're a professional. They gave me this. Regardless of that, uh, I aspire to. Maybe You're an aspiring open mic organizer. Be, be orga I can't charge the people who come to play at my open mic, right? And uh, and the club doesn't pay me, so I'm just happy they let me do it. Um, okay, so enough about me. Do they give you free drinks? Me, yes. I get, I, yeah, I'll get. Okay. I pay $15 worth of drinks and food at the club. Yeah, so let's just call that semi-professional. Right. Um, anyway, enough about that. Um, we've got some fantastic performers ready to perform. And, oh, yeah, what I really wanted to say is I used to go to a, a gang's night uh, in Vienna. And uh, Angela introduced me to them. And they were located someplace. And the open mic started to be located on Tuesday nights. And so I told them I can't come anymore because your games night is Tuesday nights. And then all of a sudden they started coming to the club where we do the open mic. Uh, the, downstairs is the open mic, upstairs is the cafe area. And in the back of the cafe area they, have, they, they move their international games community. So every time I walk in I see them playing games so off to the right. And I suggested they come down and play games at the back of the stage area so they can at least enjoy some performances and some live music while they're playing games, right? We weren't sure how far Well, it's never happened until today. Woo! And now there are games in the back of the open mic. So, I just think uh, things have a mystical way of coming together on the GoPro cruise like nowhere else uh, in the world. So, um, I'm very much looking forward to the following performances. And uh, the first person on this list is Laura Taylor. Everybody, welcome to Laura Taylor. Um, so, I just want to say, um, I have uh, absolutely no idea how the, because I haven't had a chance to actually listen to the instrumental version of this, so I really hope I, may, I match up with it. Yeah. Okay, well, give me one sec here and I will play it. Close enough to also to say we're there. We're like 30 minutes out. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Um, um, the, the you, the, you are one of the three states I haven't been oh, to. Oh, yeah. Okay. No, not yet. Yeah. Um, one of the three, and we were thinking we were going. How many persons? Seven. Seven. Sorry. Yeah. Been a while since I've been a dude. Been here, sour skin. Lots of tourists. See that Elsa looks good on you, and hey, don't feel bad, we're like you're no gal, have, that's why you gave up what we have. Let's go nights, tender days, I was half of the years for you, married vows, loving gates, and I thought that you felt that day, you switched into streams for wedding rings, while you made my heart sing, turns out you were foreshadowing. The night we met, I thought we were joking. You said you spelled it after. Too much fun for you to write the CD. When you decided it was over, you didn't bother to inform me. You couldn't be there when needed. That's the bottom line. But now you've made your bed, kinda. But me, I'm fine. Cause I was young and romantic. I trusted way too much. Believe me, I think it can stop. But after these, you're a crush. I thought we were forever. Thought that we had everything. But you're a sad case, baby. You crushed my dreams. Lost future, vanished friends. I was a pariah overnight. Falling tears, loose ends. Pardon me for trying to fight for us at first. 
first I tried to save our love, but you denied oh. true feelings you just chose to hide. New arrival, supposed friend, she was conveniently present, scheming and as he feelings spent. She saw you and said, oh my god, he's the one, I want him, I'm having fun. Who cares if his wife comes undone? They call it emotional cheating for a reason. Because it was too much, because <clears throat> it was too much effort. <laughs> Too much work for her to find <laughs> Too much work for her to find her own man. She said you should be hers. You chose to throw out what you had. You could be there when needed. That's the bottom line. And now you've made your bed kind of. For me, I'm fine. Since I was young and romantic, I trusted way too much. The little white picket fence stuff. But up but these were clutch A long list of lies she's told you But you can't even do the math Cause you're a sad case baby And she's a sociopath <laughs> Oh, adulting's only hard if you force it First you gotta, first you gotta own your shit Oh, adulting's only hard if you force it First you got it, first you got it, oh okay. <laughs> Yeah, you said you wrote it after. Too much work for you to write the tea. Communication was just too hard for you to work it out with me. You could be there when needed. That's the bottom line. And then you made your bed, kind of. But me, I'm fine. Because I'm young and romantic. I trusted way too much. Believe in my ticket fence lock. But I put these your fudge, your cowardice was like changing, but I'll be okay cause I see that you're such a baby, and now I'm free. Yeah. Woo! Woo! And that was the uh, completely Taylor. unrehearsed version. <laughs> that was Laura Taylor with the completely unrehearsed version of the end. Right? What was it called? Oh. Um, Sad case. Sad case. Sad case. All right. Thank you so much, Laura. You're uh, what? Uh, how many cruises have you been on? This is number three, non-consecutively. Non-consecutive three. Which one was your first? Five with him. It's okay. I got custody of the, custody of the cats and the Joko cooler bag. Oh, that's <laughs> important. So the song was referring to somebody. Oh, yeah. Oh, I mean, it's totally not at, um, autobiographical. No. Uh, <laughs> cool. All right. Thank you so much, Laura. All right.